<laughs> Picking a main in World of Warcraft for an upcoming expansion seems to be one of the hardest things to do. And especially in Legion, whenever you have to get an artifact weapon and build that artifact weapon up over like a really long amount of time in order to get your character to the maximum amount of power that is needed in order to be competitive. And I feel like if you're going to pick a main in Legion, it's going to be difficult, but make sure you pick the right one that you have the most fun with. And in this video, I want to talk about exactly what two classes are the most fun for me. Um, I'm going to be picking my main and then my, my also like my alt, my main alt, if that makes any sense. And the class that I'll be spending most time on whenever I don't want to be playing my main. So let's go ahead and get into it. And the first class I want to talk about is going to be my second in command character. It's going to be like my main alt or my alt in general or whatever you want to talk about. And that's going to be the Havoc Demon Hunter. In other games such as like League of Legends, I used to play Vayne um, or like Riven or something like that. And then whenever I would play Overwatch, I'd play Genji. And I think that the Demon Hunter really suits the playstyle that is more towards my identity as a gamer. Um, I think that that very high mobility, high damage character is something that I really enjoy. And I think that the Havoc Demon Hunter accomplishes that very well out of all the other classes. I think that the Windwalker Monk came close in terms of that style of play. But I really have a lot of fun with playing a character that is very oriented on just doing damage and doing a lot of it. I think that the metamorphosis and the mobility offers a lot of outplay potential whenever you're very good with it. And I think that my experience with it on the Legion beta has been very fun so far. And I want to continue it throughout Legion uh, at the point where I actually want to level up the artifact weapon. I want to put the time into it. I want to get the gear. And I think that the Demon Hunter is going to be that character for me. Uh, this character overall in Arena, you know, I spoke about this in a different video, but again, uh, the pros for it is that it's going to offer that huge amount of burst damage and metamorphosis. Uh, being able to transfer transform into that demon form is really cool to me. It offers a really high amount of mobility, um, but the cons are really revolved around the lack of defensive cooldowns, and that is just something that I'll have to deal with whenever I'm in Arena. But yeah, the Demon Hunter is going to be a lot of fun for me, and I, I look forward to being able to make videos for you guys about the Demon Hunter. And for the second class of this video, aka my main class, this is going to be something that I've played forever, okay? I've played the Mage ever since the game came out in 2004, uh, which means that I've played it for about 12 years now, and I'm going to continue that in Legion. Okay, now, so for the exact spec that I want to play, that's a really hard one right now. Um, but the thing is, is that with Mage, I feel like I, I also have that type of mobility that I really enjoy in pretty much every video game. And I also can lay down a lot of control and still get damage out if I'm skilled enough to, to you know, like make all of those damage pieces come together with the proper abilities and being most efficient with whatever spec that I'm playing. Um, I think that the Mage offers a playstyle that's really, you know, been dominant throughout World of Warcraft's history. Um, however, I think that with these recent changes that happened like four days before launch, it's really questioning as to what spec I really want to play. Um, right now, for the Legion, you know, the Legion launch, I'm going to be coming out with Fire Mage. I'm going to be playing Fire Mage because not only is it really good in PvE, which is something that I want to explore in this expansion, uh, I think that Fire Mage has capabilities in PvP, but for that recent change that happened a couple days before the expansion launching, Fire got nerfed into the ground. Pretty much every ability that Fire has that was useful got completely, like, just just way tuned down and i think that that is really really bad on blizzard's end i don't think they should have done that but uh because it, it just like completely destroys fire mage uh for pvp aspects but i think that i'm still going to work through it i'm still going to try and make it happen and if fire looks to be like completely weak and if it looks to be really terrible then i'll probably end up switching to frost mid patch or mid season because there is uh, a lot of buffs that went to frost mage over the last couple of, or last couple of days and i think that it's possible that frost might be better than fire at this point um, they both accomplish similar things, but again, if some class is going to be nerfed into the ground, then I'm going to have to switch to a different class in order to be successful. And I think that if I'm going to play Frost, that's going to be down the road because of the artifact weapon. You know, I have to level up this fire artifact weapon, and then there's the catch-up mechanics allowed for the Frost artifact weapon. But regardless, guys, we're going to be trying out Fire Mage for the next few weeks on the Legion uh, after, after launch. So let's go ahead and get into those videos over these next couple days i hope you've enjoyed this beta session with me to learn about all the different classes i wish that i could have played every single class of the game um you know from here on out but the problem is, is that the artifact weapons just take way too much time in order to level up every single class um so you know maybe i'll add more alts on throughout the expansion but definitely guys i hope you did enjoy this video looking into my mains for legion be sure to post your main down below in the comments and also leave a like on this video if you enjoyed you can subscribe to my channel for future videos and i will see you all in the next video after legion launches let's get into it guys